We're just thrilled to have you and the baby here. And me too, right? Yes, you'll be here too. The honeymoon is officially over. In Young Sheldon Season 7, Episode 8, Georgie and Mandy came home to find out Georgie was out of a job after Mima's illegal gambling room was shut down, and the Coopers were stuck with a porta potty until they could replace their septic tank. You wanted a toilet? Voila! I'm out. And that led to a moment Mandy swore would never happen. I am never living under their roof. We're at least two years away from getting our own place. Georgie, I am not living with my parents. But they moved in with their parents anyway. Mandy herself, aka Emily Osment, explained it to me like this. Yeah, us women, we change our minds. <laughs> like mother, like daughter, right? Because Mandy's mom didn't really like Georgie in episode eight. Apparently you're not job hunting today. Until she saw him reading Cece a bedtime story. Your grandma's coming around on me. And that led to Audrey giving Jim the go-ahead to offer their son-in-law a job at McAllister Auto and Tire. I could really use some help down at the tire store. Really? Selling tires? You were not going to regret this. This is a huge moment, because as Big Bang Theory fans know, Sheldon's brother eventually goes on to open his own chain of tire stores. Why did you say he's just some loser who sells tires? You're right, that was unfair. He's a loser who sells more tires than anyone in Texas. So, young Sheldon fans, did we just watch the backdoor pilot for the Georgie and Mandy spinoff show? Will the young couple live under the McAllister's roof while they save up enough money for their own place to live? And if so, are you all in on a multicam version of that show every week with a live studio audience? Or how about this pitch from Montana Jordan? They're gonna be living in a van. Yeah, oh yeah, that sounds like fun. We'll be back in the van. Look at all the room. Hell no. Let us know in the comments.